Science is an adventure. Flying is an adventure. Adventures are good. That's how we stay fresh and sharp and learn new things. My name's Karen Rodlin. I'm the Chief Scientist for Biomedical Research at Pacific Northwest National Lab. Um, but more importantly, I am a practicing scientist and a cancer biologist, and I do research with the proteomics group looking for biomarkers to detect cancer early, to predict the outcome for patients, and to identify the best therapy. I find that flying just absolutely synergizes with my role as a scientist. So I'm a big picture scientist. I look for patterns in big data. And when we go up in the airplane and we go up above Rattlesnake Mountain, we can see the landscape below us. And this ability to take a larger view, a higher view, and see patterns is essential to the way I do science. For a woman, it is very important to have role models, and I have been very, very lucky in that I've been surrounded by strong women my entire life. So and a huge impact was my mother, who was an accountant in the Depression, when women were supposed to be bookkeepers and clerks, but she was a CPA. And my earliest memories are being told, there is nothing you can't do, Karen. There is nothing a man can do that you can't do twice as well and in half the time. And that's what I grew up with. There are historical figures. Uh, perhaps my favorite is Marie Curie, not only for what she accomplished in science, but she did it as a wife and a mother. She did not have to choose between being a Nobel laureate and being a full woman. And that's always been kind of one of my goals. So as a scientist, what I enjoy most is discovering something that people didn't know before. It's a journey in the unknown. And so you do an experiment, you don't know how it's gonna turn out, you get the result, and you've learned something that people never knew before. And it's really cool if learning something about that is directly relevant to people's health. You discover a new marker for prognosis for a disease. You discover a new pathway that could be implicated in good or bad outcome. And so working hand in hand with clinician scientists, you can start to impact human health and human medical treatment for chronic diseases. So that's the biggest passion. Then there's always the joy of working with young people, mentoring them, bringing them along, helping them learn how to be better scientists, how to write grants, how to write papers, how to identify the important question. That's the other side of my job and that's truly gratifying.